there is a great benefit from jarring oneself out of our normal state of being in order to radically change our perspectives and broaden our horizons of what is and what isn't. My name is Stuart Holland and I'm a visionary charcoal artist. Conceptually with my art, I try to depict a sort of crossroads of the physical and spiritual realms and being able to look deeper at ourselves and deeper into the fabric of reality and the cosmos at large. Martin Whitfoot has been a really inspirational artist conceptually and technically. I used to deal strictly with animals in my artwork. Has really influenced me in exploring these liminal states of what is and what isn't and what could be. Very much like myself, he has been heavily influenced uh, by psychedelic experiences and recently shamanism as a means of sort of mediating these two worlds of like the animal, the human, and the divine. It's an engaging of the material world as a means to engage in spiritual discovery and exploration. The thing that I enjoy about charcoal as a medium is that you have this object, a living piece of matter that in essence is light and has then gone and died a sort of state change from light to darkness. That matter is then burned to form the charcoal that you use back to darkness again. I feel that that sort of state change from light to darkness and then using the resulting darkness to then speak conceptually about light makes a very strong statement about the light and darkness that's so timeless in our universe, both physically and spiritually.